Welcome back to Let's Play Sphinx and the Cursed Mummy, Burning Dog fans. We're here in Heliopolis, where uh, I've fully healed myself off-camera, and uh, gotten a few more dollar dues. I can at least afford passage back to Heliopolis now. I'm not sure how much it costs to do this matching minigame behind me. Uh, what does Slaws and Drapper say? Get back in there, champ! Okay. <sighs> Welcome to my game. It costs ten Scarabury dues to play. Would you like to play? Yes! Use thine blowpipe to shoot open the doors at the end of the room. And teach pair of items behind the doors to win. If you can complete the game within 60 seconds, you'll have proven yourself worthy of the Medal of Memory. Damn it! That's why I misplaced the other purple one. Uh, that was here, I think. Is that here or here? Fuck it, let's go for it. Must be here. Damn it! Didn't make it. Yay. Congratulations, you've won 20 scarabs. Neat! I'm gonna walk right up to it, because I'm pretty sure. Yes, they. Oh no, they are technically three dimensional, they're just basically painted on cardboard. Fair enough. That for sure they'd just be flat sprites, like, uh... You know, Flat Mummy. Actually, I think Flat Mummy is, uh... Just his regular 3D model with one of the dimensions uh, reduced to zero. Or maybe one. How much dosh was that? Okay. Let's head back to Heliopolis. What? Uh -huh. Let's go with that statue in place. I haven't forgotten what I'm doing. I, think I don't have any more of those. That would be a very useful place for it. The one I stuck over there is probably the least useful place I could have put it. Okay. I was expecting, like, uh... Oh, there was treasure there. Here is, like, 30 scarabs. 
Wait. Uh... Oh! Hunter Bronze Glass, a certificate from the Abydos Museum presented to you for collecting ten monsters. Atun Statue. A golden statue of the god Atun, said to be the only means to break the magical seal of Atun. Someone is not having a good day. Hello? You alright, buddy? Keta! Keta, where are you? What am I going to do? My wife has gone missing! I woke this morning and she was gone. Oh dear, something bad has happened to her. I can feel it. I thought I heard her voice in this building, but I'm too afraid to go inside. Curse my cowardice! Please go inside and rescue her. I'm begging you! Heliopolis has become such a terrible place. Monsters everywhere. People cursed and cast into stone. And now my poor Keta. Please help me! Hello? That guy's wife? Anybody? I didn't even get that guy's name, just hers. Hmm. How strange. Oh well, who didn't see this coming? Oh shit. Ah! Ah! Get it off! Ah! Which means you two are expendable. Eat shit. I do the stomp on double jump. Get off my legs, you bastards! Oh my god! Uh, uh, Shield of Osiris. Well, that isn't good. Oh, I hate this. How the hell do I get up there? No, oh, that's how. Health! Yummy! Asp! Uh, ah! Ah! Whoa! Oh, that's why. They're literally different kinds. Full again! Oh my god, wow! Okay, I don't like this one bit. Oh no, it only harms explosive monsters! Shit. Where'd he go? God, really? You're mine! Oh. Great.
gonna level with you. I would have preferred some health right then. I didn't know that was there. I'm just paranoid at this point. Now are you not invincible? Oh god! No, he's still invincible. He's just an asshole. Yeah, fuck that guy. Wait. I wonder if I could hit him with one of these slim burbles. Fine, let's do what we're obviously supposed to do. Oh god! Stupid. No. If I do not attune, I. No! So if I haven't picked it up yet, he loses his charge after he does the stompy attack for a little bit. But not that attack. And so, he passed on to Valhalla, a valiant warrior. Shit! God. Ah, oh, fuck. God. Damn it! Fuck! Hate. Life's problems. <laughs> I suppose I could just walk there now, huh? Well, oh, fuck it, I'm already up the rope. So I'm going to catch some more of those guys so I can try that idea I'm not even sure will work. God damn it, you were life last time. You never know when you're going to need one. How are the exploding guys easier to capture than the fire guys? You actually have to get in close to them. Fucking A, man. How many 
is that? <laughs> well, we do have two eyes of a two, and so I'm going to go activate that uh, stone head I was talking about. Oh. I didn't even know those were there. Clearly! Dum -dum -dum. Oops. Ah, oh, scratch my leg. Ah. It's practically Naruto running. Although I would su I would suspect that this game predates Naruto by a significant margin. So first I'm going to run over here and save the game. I'm going to see if I can get all the way back up to the temple. Or whatever the fuck that is. Oh, I'm going to have to kill all those guys again. Saving the world is never easy. I do like the deanimation changes. That's neat. Not bad. Oops. Forgot I was actually in the area. Are those speed plates just sticking up out of the ground? I guess there was also one there next to the crying man, wasn't there? Oh, and I just can't leave him weeping over the fate of his wife. God damn it! Nope, no, nope, fuck you. Thank you. Oh, actually, uh. Half Brute. The name Half Brute understates the nature of these aggressive two legged monsters. While their unwieldy gait makes them slow, they are capable of stomping the ground with enough force to make send a powerful shockwave into all those around. Mummy Chihuahua. These little dogs are none too pleased about being mummified, so try not to get close. If you make that mistake, expect them to cling to you and bite away until they are shaken off. No! Frickin' purse dogs! Ow! Oh. Mummy worm. Ha! That looked really good! I didn't do it on purpose, but it looked good. Borg, I am slain. All right, you fucker. Oh, uh... I didn't seem to do anything. 
Okay, so I assume I need to kill that guy in order to get the, uh, the thing. Ah! But, uh, you know, the key to that thing up there, but I... Hmm. I can't hurt him in any way. Maybe this is one of those, uh, better part of Valor things, huh? Alright, I'll get your wife back, just... Not until the next session. Okay. <laughs> it's kind of hard to turn around like this. Because the timer went, and now I can do this. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you in the next episode of Let's Play Sphinx and the Cursed Mummy, when we uh, continue trying to save Keta, and figure out where that key might be. Later! <laughs>